Hey, how's it going, everybody? Lethal One here. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Castlevania Rondo of Blood. Last episode, we made some good progress. We found all the maidens. We just have one left, and that's Annette. Annette, Richter's girlfriend. Hopefully, we find her in this stage. I'm going to keep my eye out. Let's get started. Stage seven. Oh, I've actually seen this stage before. I've seen a friend of mine, Goblin. He was playing this stage, and he was very frustrated because of the old... Oh, here we go. Yep, the old Belmont curse. It seems the whip doesn't really hurt these bats as much, so I'm gonna be trying to throw axes and keep moving. As long as I don't run out. Oh no, this is not the ideal way to do it. You know, I'm starting to have a, a whole new respect for the axe. It's not mainstream like the Holy Cross or Holy Water, but it gets the job done. All right, that was pretty easy actually with the axe. Sorry, Goblin. <laughs> Hope you watch this. Oh, this looks like the clock tower. So we are at the end of the game. Everybody who's a Castlevania fanatic knows the clock tower is the end. Oh, I know what that is. I know what this is from Symphony of the Night. Could this be where Annette is? It can't be that easy, could it? Oh, not a net, but it's the key. I'm gonna mix that, miss the X, but that's okay. We got the key. Now let's hold on to it. Oh yeah, clock tower. Horrifying. Oh no, I hate those things. They dodge you really good. Look at this. Oh, that wall. The wall that looks like a granola bar. Definitely hiding a secret. There we go. Could that be a net? Nope. It's actually even better. There she is. All right. Hunter, after all, I need to let a little out once in a while. Oh, well then. <laughs> you head back to the village without me. I'm going on ahead. It's time to end this 100 year blood feud. Me? Yeah. I'm gonna kill him myself. No, don't. It's too dangerous. But this is my destiny. Besides, his blood is calling to me. The path up to here is safe. Now get going. Richter! Wait! Richter! Come back. Come back in one piece. Please. Alright, we did it. That's everybody. Let's get up this clock tower before things get worse. It's kind of weird not having Medusa heads on here. This is, uh where Medusa heads thrive. The clock tower replaced with these respawning water monsters. Come on, get down here, gear. Yeah, this is pretty tough. Uh, spoke way too soon. I, I think I can make this jump actually. Let's see. Oh no, I back flipped the wrong way. Got it. I'm only gonna try this one more time. The Medusa heads are running rampant right now. Come on, you can do it. Yep, we gotta do it the hard way. Did the music restart? Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah! Oh, that sucks if you attack. You fall off the gear. Come on. Get up there, get up there. 
Yes! I know it's a way to jump up there, but obviously I'm not skilled. Oh, look at the moon right there. A little half moon. <laughs> not you. You are indeed the most heavily armored dude I've ever seen. He also screaming for a whooping. Oh, okay, that wasn't too bad. Just gotta be careful. No! Wait, what is this? Granola wall again. Nice, okay. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can keep moving forward. I'm in a bad spot. Okay, just run. Oh, the armor is too thick. I was trying not to die again. That didn't work out too well. If it all wasn't for this long neck asshole up here, knocking me down. All right, let's see if I can get past him. I don't understand. Sometimes you can press. Yeah, you piece of crap. Sometimes you can press the item crash when you have just the whip and it'll do an attack. There's a candle up here. Okay, nice. If I get in trouble, I know to fall down that hole and there is a health there. There is a turkey chop for the taking. Hopefully I won't need it. Oh yes, I am in crash time. Now, if I get overwhelmed, I'll be all right. You piece of crap. I should keep the axe. Nah. I think the axe will just bounce off these guys. I learned this mechanic. If you hold down the whip button, you can actually back up, and it's pretty fast. Let's see what this is up here. And the statue is pointing down. So we're going down. Oh, this is gonna dodge all of my stuff. I think I will keep the Holy Cross. At least I'll get two item crashes. Oh, there's something up here. Almost made that. I don't know, I, I did some kind of weird glitch, I guess. Almost. I'm pretty sure that's not the way that it was intended, so I'm gonna keep going forward. Nothing in the walls. Nothing on that wall. <laughs> I thought he was gonna jump out. Oh, okay, he's pointing this way. Does he mean like up here? Look at that, that's dirty. Freaking life bar hiding this stuff. I'm trying to see the range on that attack. Yep, I should have known better. I think I'm gonna go back for that health. That's the awesome thing about this game. Once you kill something, they don't come back. All right, luckily for me, I kept the Holy Cross. It's pointing down. Oh, okay, that's what those stairs was for. Okay, I'm gonna go all the way back real quick. Well, it's not gonna be that quick, but I'm gonna get that granola bar up there. It's housing the meat. So looking at the color pattern, it's this one. All right. All right, that was very fortunate. Let's get back up there. So I walked off before. I think I need to make like a 
like a little minor jump in order to make it to the staircase. And the statue is trying to send us off, tell us to go the other way. I mean, technically he's right. We do have to go this way. So, looking at the bricks. Got it. All right, nothing in the wall. Oh, no. Oh, that was so lucky. If I had Grant, I could have made this jump. Sweet. I definitely don't want that. But I want to see what that candle is up there. Oh, goodness. Okay, I wasn't trying to do that. I just want to know what that candle is. Yeah, let's take it. I feel like it was up there for... Oh, this reminds me of that Castlevania 2 fan-made game. You know what? No, I'm just going to keep the holy water. Yeah, where every block has a certain item that can only break that block. Look at this. I get two item crashes. This is so hard to do sometimes. Why not just give him a double jump? All right, who could this be? Grim Weeper's down. Chaff down. Only Dracula left, really. How are you still alive? Maybe he's not alive. Ah, oh, his ghost is here. Oh, crap. Is that the thing I killed earlier? Oh, you're getting another item crash. Oh! How do you dodge that? Oh, no, 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 no. Slow motion. Yep, you keep calling this guy down here. That's the problem. Once I run out of item crashes, I'm in trouble. Oh, okay, I'm dead. I didn't know he had that guy, too. Oh, that was lucky. Come on, I can do this. I can't believe I just did that. First try. Okay, guys. I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. If you guys enjoyed this, give me a thumbs up. Let me catch this. And until next time, peace. I can't believe I got that on the first try. <laughs>